First introduced in 1958, the original Super Cub went on to being gifted with the title of the machine that mobilized post-war Japan. Fast forward 60 years, and in 2017, Honda celebrated the production of its 100 millionth iteration of the model. The modern-day Super Cub take the classic style and mechanical simplicity of the original, adding in some modern tech and a significant amount of style. Heading up the changes of the 2022, Honda Super Cub 125 is a new engine that is claimed to be smoother and more economical than before. Peak power is up slightly, and the new Super Cub is of course Euro 5 compliant. The 2022 Honda Super Cub draws power from a Euro 5 compliant 124cc air-cooled engine that generates a maximum power of 9.8 horsepower at 7,500 rpm and 10.4 nanometer of peak torque at 6,250 rpm. The mill is linked to a four-speed gearbox. Unlike the 2022 Honda Monkey, the Super Cub stays true to its roots with a four-speed gearbox, with neutral at the bottom. As before, power is transmitted by way of a centrifugal clutch, doing away with the need for a clutch lever. As with any small-capacity Honda, the claimed fuel economy of the 2022 Honda Super Cub is staggering, with the bike returning a claimed 156 miles per gallon. That means, the thimble-like 3.7-liter fuel tank enables a theoretical range of more than 150 miles. Leaving the bike's now legendary styling as it is, Honda instead focused on the new bike's ride quality, introducing revised springs in the front forks and rear shocks to improve on-road handling. A modern finishing touch for the retro-styled machine is the introduction of the Honda Smart Key system, which also controls the immobilizer as an extra theft deterrent. The system also has an answer back function, whereby the indicators will blink at the push of a button to make finding the vehicle easy in busy parking areas. The 2022 Honda Super Cub 125 should be landing in dealerships in August 2021. The new bike is available in one color, which is the stealthy Mad Axis gray metallic option you can see here. It's priced at £3,499 on the road.